Hello and welcome to this video. My name is Zaid Ibrahim and I am a network engineer from Citilecoms. Today we will talk about some key configuration to be done in all networks. I will talk about something called NTB server, which is short for Network Time Protocol. The NTB server is the place where your devices and applications sync their time. Many applications need the correct time in order to work properly. For example, like the billing application. I will demonstrate here how to configure the NTP in a Cisco router and how you can sync your, your Cisco router to a public NTP server. Let's begin here. This is my Cisco router. I will configure this, this Cisco router as a local NTP server to all my local div uh, network devices. Okay. For, ex uh, for start, let's, for, let's show the clock right now in the uh, Cisco router. As you can see, the clock here, the time here is wrong. The time here is 10.40 UTC Saturday and it's 5, 5 September 1998. For sure, this time is wrong. We are now in uh, September 6, uh, 2016. So what we need to do here, we need to con uh, we need to configure this as an NTB server, and we need to sync the correct time from a public NTB server to this router, okay? And then the last step, we will configure one of our switches to sync their time from the Cisco router here, okay? First of all, we need to make sure we can reach a public NTB server. The public NTB server uses uses uh, a name instead of an IP address so we need to ha we need uh, the r this router to be able to resolve DNS names to IP addresses okay to do that we need to configure IP name server which is to configure a DNS server in the router so the router can resolve DNS names to IP addresses As an example for a famous NTB server, this right here is zero.asia.pool.ntp.org. This server is a public NTB server. You can sync your time from it anywhere. Okay, it's allowed for all. First of all, we make sure we can reach the server. Second, we configure this NTB. We sync our time from this router to the public NTB. We use the command NTB server and then we put this server. We copy and paste the server, okay? And then we continue with the command prefer. The command prefer basically makes this NTB server your primary. Of course, you can configure another NTB server as a backup. For example, you can configure one.asia pull this will you will, this will be sorry this will be another a backup NTB server for your router okay the last command here is NTP master the NTB master here basically is the main command to make this router an NTB server for your local devices and applications when, when you put the command NTB master, now this router can be used as an NTB server to other devices. Before we go to the other devices, let's confirm this device got the right time. Okay. And let's confirm it's uh, the time is synced successfully with public NTB. There's this command, show NTB associations. Okay. As you can see here, there is uh, a lot of stuff. Uh, the public IP, this one, 218.189.210.4, this is the public IP for the, the, for the public NTB server robot, which is zero.asia.pool.ntb.org. The router resolved the name to an IP address, and the sync is working correctly. How do I know that? Because I can see the star right here. That means the router is syncing their time from this server. And here we can see a plus, which is what? Which is a candidate NTP server. And the router will sync to this IP address uh, in case of failure of the primary. Okay. 
let's see show clock what is the time right now yeah so we have here September 6 2016 and the time here is what is 622 okay I have the time in my laptop right now is 922 p.m. so the time is wrong no the time is not wrong actually uh, the time is right perfectly but as you can see here the time zone is GMT the time zone here in Saudi Arabia is uh, GMT plus 3 so in order to think the time correctly we configure the time zone which is clock time zone let's name it KSA and 3 now we we try the command show clock sorry the command show clock now it shows the right time which is 9.22 and the time zone correctly is KSA the configuration of the NTP server is done to review it we need to configure first a public NTP server we need to be sure we can reach it okay then configure a public NTP server using the NTP server command then configure the router with an NTP master command okay and of course we'll show NTP associations to make sure that the sync is working properly with the star sign on the NTP server okay now let's go to a local switch here and try to sync the right time to it this is a local switch in the same network okay let's try first show clock as you can see here as well the time is wrong on this switch so we don't need to configure this switch with a public we can we can the best recommendation here is configure one device from your local network to a public NTP server and then configure all your local devices to a local NTP server in our case our router here synced with the public NTP now we configure this switch to sync with the router okay the same thing here but we don't need a DNS of course we need to configure first we need to configure the time zone which is KSA3 and then we configure the NTB server in, the, in our case which is the IB address of the router and then with the command prefer or without it it's your choice it's optional okay and then we show NTB associations okay still it didn't get the time we need to wait a little bit let's try the show clock command sorry okay it got the time as you can see here before the time was 1 12 and 1992 now the time is correct which is 9 24 and KSA September 6 2016 okay this means the NTB server is working properly and the time is syncing correctly to the local switch you can do this to all your Cisco devices as well you can uh, you can choose to sync uh, any time from any application to the NTP master here we configured you can do whatever you like uh, uh, this way we configured a local NTP server in your network and you choose how to configure other application to sync from it okay thank you and have a nice day